Thanks for stopping by. Today we're going to talk about fitness. Not this kind of fitness, but evolutionary fitness. Evolutionary fitness can be generally defined as an organism's capacity to survive and reproduce in a given environment. But let's break this definition down a little further. So first, fitness starts in the genes. It's the fitness of the genotypes and phenotypes that determine the survival of a species, or rather the survival of certain genes within that species. So when we talk about survival, it's not necessarily the fastest or the strongest that survive, but those with the best advantage in that environment. Examples include traits like camouflage to hide from predators, um, acute night vision for hunting prey, or even sleeping with one eye open to stay alert, like our friend the dolphin. Right, but this is only half the story. The ability to reproduce and pass on those genes is just as important as survival. Right, this is where sexual selection comes in. Examples of sexual sele selection traits um, include traits such as feather or coat color for attracting a mate, uh, mating songs or dances, and also uh, even physical competition for mating rights. So again, fitness deals with both survival and reproduction. And if you have one but not the other, genes will not likely be passed on to the next generation. And that's it. So if you found this video helpful, give it a like and share it with your classmates. They probably need the help too. And be sure to check out my other videos. And if you have any questions, um, throw them in the comments, or you can check the link in the description for more information and examples about evolutionary fitness. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you next time.